Hello everyone, this is Taria from Hidden Truth Tarot, and this is going to be your daily reading for Thursday the 7th of March 2019. This is for the collective, it's for all signs. I also do weekly and monthly videos, if you would like to go and check those readings out, that would be awesome. And I just want to thank each and every one of you for uh, viewing my readings, it shows support for my channel. All right, I'm using the messages from your animal spirit guides along with messages, uh, well, your archangel uh, messages, and I'm using the Morgan Greer Tarot deck for the reading today. I will also be pulling a daily positive thoughts and affirmation card at the end of the reading, guys. All right. So we're going to go ahead and we are going to, oh how cute. Alright, we're going to start with uh, your animal spirit guides first. We have cat, domestic, it's time to strike out on your own and relinquish your over dependency on others. Very interesting. So with this coming out here, I feel like for some of you, uh, you're just now leaving the nest, you know, leaving home or maybe um, maybe even graduating from college, uh, moving forward with your life, getting your own place. Uh, I feel like for some of you, if you have roommates or if you've been in that type of situation where you've shared housing with someone else, I feel like you have a, a deep feeling uh, right now to live on your own um, you're tired of living with other people I'm getting that very strongly um, you're ready to just have a place of your own so that's very nice now we have compassion coming out here this is Archangel Zadkiel I hope I said that right soften your heart with respect to this situation and all the people involved including yourself Soften your heart with respect to this situation and all the people involved, including yourself. So, I feel like if you are around people that are maybe going through a hard time or you yourself and others are going through a hard time, uh, it's going to be very important for you to be able to allow yourself to be co uh, compassionate towards others as well as with yourself, you guys. All right, let's see what Spirit has for us today. All right, I just love these um, Spirit Guide, Animal Spirit Guide cards. Yeah, I feel like for many of you, you're ready to start your own life, whether that's moving um, out of your parents' house, um, moving out of the dorm in college, uh, getting your own place instead of having roommates. <laughs> I feel like this is grown-up day. Awesome. All right. We are ready, guys. Oh, nice. We have the Nine of Cups coming out. Beautiful energy. We have the Page of Cups. We have the Emperor. Three of Cups. Very nice. The Fool. And the Seven of Cups. Alright. We're going to go ahead. We're going to do the Nine of Cups first. And it's clarified by the Three of Cups. So... I think we all know by now this is a, a, a wish fulfillment card right here. Very nice energy. This is emotional satisfaction, um, pleasure, um, just really having uh, abundance. Uh, your cup runneth over uh, emotional, you know, abundance and satisfaction, you guys. This is happiness. This is you going after your dream, after your wish, um, and being successful at it. I see it's very positive because it has the Three of Cups clarifying it. And the Three of Cups is a, a beautiful um, energy here with celebration, you know, friendships, team spirit, people getting together to celebrate. Uh, this could be um, 
like I said, I feel like because this came out right here, you guys, I feel like for many of you, you're having a new beginning of moving out. Um, whatever that means to you. But independence is like, you know, like going through my mind, like really, really strong right now. I feel like, um, and you do have new beginnings here uh, in this reading as well. And I just feel like this is something that you've been waiting on, you've been wishing for, and now you are able to fulfill this dream that you have. Whether this is moving out on your own, this could be going after a wish or a dream. Uh, but you're celebrating it. This is something that you know. That, that it's tangible. It, you can have it. And the Three of Cups is, is, you know, getting together and celebrating that with your friends as well. And this is growth. You know, I look at threes. That's a, that's a number of growth and expansion, you know, in our life as well. Now we have the Page of Cups clarified by the Fool. The Page of Cups is a very... You know, this can represent, uh, you know, Cancer, Scorpio, Pisces energy. This is all about intimacy, romantic feelings, sensitivity, uh, that psychic ability. This could also be maybe um, messages coming in about love or something that means a lot to you. Something that uh, causes deep emotions to well up with inside of you as well, you guys. And I just love this. Because I, I feel like you're going with your gut instinct today. You're going with the ebb. And you're going with the flow. And with the full clarifying this, this is new journeys. This is, you know, freedom, uh, new beginnings, taking a leap of faith. And I love these two because I feel like you are listening to what's going on inside of you. Your your own instinct, that natural ability that you have that's that's given to us at birth, that gut instinct, and you're going with it, and you're allowing yourself to start a new beginning, something that you're very excited about, taking that leap of faith. So, very nice energies, you guys. Now we have the Emperor, clarified by the Seven of Cups. I love the Emperor. He gets a bad rap sometimes because he can be controlling, uh, but I feel like this is asserting yourself uh, in this new beginning, I feel like, taking that leap of faith, you know, having authority and structure in your life. This can also represent new projects as well. Um, this is the energy of Aries, a very bold and strong energy. Um, this is, you know, Doing what you want uh, is what I'm getting from this. And I, and it's clarified by the Seven of Cups. Now, the Seven of Cups can be about fantasizing, maybe um, daydreaming. But I feel like you have... I, I don't see this right here because it is clarifying the Emperor. The Emperor is all about structure, okay? This is something that's built on a strong foundation that's going to last, whether it's a job, getting your own place... Um, moving forward, taking that leap of faith, I feel like you have many opportunities that are on the table for you. Um, I feel like you don't just have one choice. I do feel like for, you know, this might just be for a handful of people. I feel like you are in college or you're in a position where you can change up what it is you want your life path or your direction, what you want to do um, on a day-to-day -day basis as far as working, what your skill is, what you're going to school for. I feel like you have many opportunities. And for others, this is just knowing that you're standing in your power and that you have that control and structure in your life. And you, I feel like, you are mature enough and you have enough power to go by your gut instinct and go within yourself, you guys, to make any decision that you have on the table work for you. Okay, whatever whatever this cup that you're needing to pick, or, or maybe it's more than one. Maybe you have uh, more than one uh, opportunities to choose from or you can, you know, choose two. I mean, only you know... Uh, how this resonates with you but I feel like there's many and I feel like you're not going to go wrong with them with the emperor clarifying I mean the, with this clarifying the emperor I'm so sorry got tongue twisted because like I said he knows what he wants he's he's got the power he's got the control okay 
So I feel like you guys have this. Uh, this is a beautiful reading. I mean, it's very positive. Uh, you're going after your dreams, your wishes, whatever that might be. You could be writing. Some of you could be musicians. Some of you could, you know, I, I'm getting singers as well and art. Some of you could be, um, not art, what is the world, uh, architect. Uh, that came to my mind, so... You might be going to school to be an architect. That's awesome. But I'm getting creative arts as well, you guys. You guys are going for it. Oh, nice. All right. I don't worry about things I can't control. Instead, I choose peace. I trust everything works out for my well-being. Very nice, you guys. And... I feel like that's very important to have faith in the universe and have that trust. Um, just go with the flow. I, I really do feel like as long as you go with the ebb and flow today, you have a lot of beautiful energy here. And, I mean, this could, this could literally be, like I said, for some of you, stepping out, moving uh, forward, taking a leap of faith moving out on your own, maybe switching jobs. This could have to do with career, um, as far as choosing a career in college or a trade school as well, you guys. All right, I love you guys. I want to thank you so much, and I send you all my love, wishes, and blessings, and I will see you tomorrow. Bye-bye.